Two major school districts in our region will be coming back to the classroom with big changes when it comes to transportation. Columbus City Schools completely redoing its bus routes. So has Reynoldsburg City School District. NBC 4's Karina Chung spoke to parents about these changes and joins us now live. Karina, what do we know? Jen, Reynoldsburg City Schools returned back to the classroom today and Columbus City Schools is back tomorrow morning. Now both districts are seeing these changes after the holiday break. Yellow bus transportation. Columbus City School parent Matt Monjot says there is a little anxiety about bus route changes and a smooth start in 2023. I fear it won't, but I'm really hoping that it will. I mean, with all the changes, of course, there's going to be some hiccups. Columbus City Schools has completely overhauled its bus routing system. Starting Wednesday, there will be new routes, new bus stops, new drivers, or all of the above. What was the longest acceptable walk for a kid? How did you evaluate if the walk they have to make is safe? Um, what was the longest time a kid can be on a bus? And does every kid who needs a bus have a bus now? Scott Varner with Columbus City Schools says they've sent out notices and have had their call center open to help with any questions or concerns. Our call center, we've doubled the number of people taking calls, and they've had several hundred calls today, well over 200 uh, earlier this morning. So we know that number will increase, especially tomorrow. At the start of the school year, Reynoldsburg City Schools was juggling in-person and remote learning because of the bus driver shortage. Their students came back to class today with busing changes. For us, it was pretty much business as usual. Just um, this morning, there was a lot more time for my daughter, but my son's school stayed the same, so they're on different schedules now. Reynoldsburg also changed the start and end times of the school day for some buildings. My daughter is going to be cutting it real close to getting to her sporting events after school um, because she's in fourth grade and she's involved in a little bit more stuff. Um, so that's going to be a little stressful. The Columbus School Board of Education is meeting tonight for its regular meeting at 530. I'm told that transportation and the changes that families will see tomorrow will also be discussed. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Karina Chung, NBC4.